Hey guys, welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be a haul of some things that I've bought in the last couple of months. There have been so many releases recently. So let's get into it. So first thing, uh, Line Friends had a sale recently. They always have sales, so I always check it out just to see if there's anything that I want. And this time they did have some stuff that I wanted. So there's this shark brown he's so cute i absolutely love him he has like little fins and everything um and then so the bt21 like flat baby plush characters <laughs> i didn't remember what they're called but they were there's a couple of them on sale so i got them too i want to buy all of them but i think i'm gonna just wait for them to go on sale since two of them did go on sale this time so this is RJ. He's really soft and he's like super fuzzy and super cute. And I also got cookies. Which... And then I got a little mini Koya. I want to put these on my Bud's case because he's just so cute. But I don't want him to get dirty because he's really fuzzy. So I don't know what I want to do yet. But it's like in the back of my head all the time. Like you should put him on your Bud's case. So I might just do it. And then the Map of the Soul Tour stuff. So for the pickets, I always buy Jungkook and Jin's if I'm able to. And then I always buy like another member, like whoever's photo is my favorite from that like concert era or whatever, like in the picket form, like whoever's picture I like the most, I try to get. And I always try to buy group, but I always miss it. And so Jungkook, B. Yungi. So Yungi's is actually the one that I had bought as my extra and then V I think what had happened was because I wanted to buy all seven of them But I couldn't afford all seven of them at the time So I like added them all to my cart and I just wanted to see how much it would cost to buy them And then I deleted them out of my cart and I forgot to delete V's I think is what happened But then they all come with this like cute little like name like uh like keychain type thing to put on the bottom of these and then group so this time I was actually able to get group because for global I, I bought all my stuff on global um, I was able to get everything without any problems just because things took a little bit longer to sell it than the US site which I was really like thankful for so I was able to get the group one and then I got all of the premium photos so I got Namjoon Jin, Yoongi, Hobi, Jimin, V, and Jungle. So, and I bought the NTT Dream, the Dream Show photo book slash live CD. I took out all of the photo cards from any like albums or anything just so things could be faster and I know there are other videos out there who like flip through all of them so I don't really see a reason for me to have to open it and like flip through them. Let's move on to the next thing. So I, my friend and I had decided we wanted to try and pull a Polaroid from these Kinos. Uh, we didn't but we each bought 20 of them so there was 40 in total and we we're like Maybe, just maybe. So our plan was like, if we had pulled a uh, Mark, Hechan, Do Young, or Taeyong, we're gonna keep it. So for her, it would have been Mark or Hechan, and then me for Taeyong or Do Young. And then if we had any other member, we would decide what we would do next. But we didn't pull one, so it didn't really matter. Um, I sold all of the photo cards, and I have like 20 <laughs> kinos left, or something like that. At least 20 of them left, and I'm probably gonna give them away when things start like coming back to normal because like I live in Houston and we do a lot of cup sleeve events and it'll be easy to just hand them out there but right now nothing is going on so I can't just give it away and then I got the reload Kino so I'll show all the photo cards at the end so I hope you guys anticipate and then I bought a bundle from somebody like a secondhand seller of like Jamin stuff because there were a couple things in the bundle that I wanted and she was only selling in a bundle so I was just like I'm gonna buy it <laughs> um so there's this like dream show like ID tag this is one of the things that I had wanted and then this 
um, dream show like lanyard this is the other thing that I had wanted so these are the two things that I really wanted and that's why I got it and then this like um Jamin uh the dream cd I know there's like one for each member and then there's a group one so this fan so and then this like um they're like membership like postcard there's like a she just gave me the Jamin one um and then next so i bought a few slogans i bought three slogans um and then it came with these buttons and then this like uh sm superstar sm town inspired lenticular and then here's the slogan which is really cute. He has like little bunny ears. And then it says Kim Do Young on the back. Oh, there's more stuff in here. And then there's two postcards. And then here's another slogan. And this one comes with like Polaroid inspired postcards. Sorry for the shadow. Um I can't get rid of it. I don't know if I said that already, but yeah, if I did, I'm sorry. But if I didn't, it's kind of annoying, but I'm sorry. <laughs> and then this is the slogan. It's so cute. I really wanted it because he looks so baby and his hand is so tiny. And I'm like, I want to compare what my hand size would be to his because I have small hands too. So I'm like, if we have the same size hands, that'd be so cute. And on the back, it says, Doyang. And then the last slogan it comes with this button and this like fan art button and some postcards. And it also comes with this like mini poster. And this is what the slogan looks like. So it's like kind of similar shot as the other one where he has like a bunny headband. But they're different, I promise. And it says Doyang on the back. You can read that. Okay. And next, so there's this like um, dream show name badge, I think that Mark had signed and decorated. And then, so next is this Mark Cherry Bomb keychain. I really like the design of the Cherry Bomb characters. I don't know if that's like unpopular opinion or not, but they're so cute in my opinion. And then this Neo City voice keychain. It's Jaehyun. My friend had given this to me. The like sound is kind of off, so I'm not gonna play it. And then I got this Mark and Doyoung like glitter keychains. Um, I really, so my friend collects them and then I saw the Doyoung one and I was like, I really want it. <laughs> so I asked her if I could buy it from her. And then she was selling her Mark one, so I bought that one too. So then next, so I have this Love Yourself keychain. So I had gone to the tour and I waited in line for merch. And I don't know if it was like when I was in line, I didn't want it or like I had was like, oh my gosh, I'm already spending so much money that I shouldn't buy it. But when I went on sale for like the pop up, I decided to get it because it's just so cute. And I collect these keychains. I have almost every single one that they have released. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, I was like, let me just get this really quick. And then I got the uh, fourth Foster lenticular keychain trying to like change it but it's like not showing there it is and then the final round album so i did a group order for this and i bought five sets for the group order and all of the first player ones were like bought <laughs> and the second player ones weren't so i have two second player ones and no first player ones right now i did buy like six more albums but those aren't sets so I don't know if it's going to be like one version or if it's going to be like they like me and they're going to send me sets of them. So I guess we'll see when I get them in the mail. 
and then I did another group order for the reload albums I think I bought 15 sets for the group order and then on my birthday I had gone to my local k-pop store and was like I want a set now <laughs> so I had bought in 16 sets in total and I think seven of them were for the group order and then I have the rest of them so I'm probably gonna sell the extra ones that I have um, I don't know if it'd be easier for me to sell it like together or separately so I'm just gonna like post them up on my like selling Twitter and just see if people buy them and then I bought all, wavy, all of Wavy's like crane press albums because I've been wanting to buy them but I hadn't yet just been putting it off and the other day I decided I'm just gonna buy them all because I know my local k-pop store had them so I have take over the moon take over the moon sequel and then awaken the world both versions I also and then I got this my friend gave me this doyoung fan and it has like a little baby doyoung polaroid and then I have these two lucky draws so I bought a lot of them I don't remember how many I've bought I think I have like 10 more coming in the mail it's either 5 or 10 or something in between because like you have to spend $30 for free shipping within Korea and I ship all of like my um, BTS like Weaver stuff to a Korean address like a proxy and one of them I know for sure was like less than $30 so I bought at least one in that order and then another order I did I bought five more and I think there was another one that I also bought five more but I'm not too sure so I have at least six more coming in the mail um, <laughs> and I have no idea why I bought so many because I mean it's not like I'm gonna put these up Jimin and Jin, they're really cute. Um, they're really serious. I really prefer like photos of them smiling. But I feel like these like uh, member specific things from tours and stuff, they don't really smile in those photos for some reason. And it's really sad because they're so cute when they smile. But that's fine. And then so I got three of these fans, these like mini handy fans for the Baby BT 21 characters. But these ones are really tiny. Um, it comes with a charger and a lanyard. And then the user manual. And then the fan. Look how small it is. It's like the size of my hand. And like they compared it to a phone in the photos. But it's so precious. And I can't wait to use them. I don't know how like powerful it will be. So I hope it's like good enough for me to sit outside <laughs> all day with. But so I got Koya, and then I got Mong, then here's the fan. I really like the um, bigger ones. I have the version 1 ones, not the version 2. So I'm not too sure what the version 2s look like, but I like the version 1 ones because they have the little butt sticking out in the back, which I think is so adorable. And then I got a cookie one. I can't decide which one I wanted, so I just decided to get these three because they're my favorite out of the three, uh, out of the seven. We'll move on to like postcards, posters, photo cards, and circle card pulls, um, because SM's extra and they like to put all of that stuff in these albums. So for the final round, um, postcards, I got Jungwoo, Yuta, Johnny. Jaehan and <laughs> Jungwoo. Um, in my next set, if I don't get Doyoung, I'm probably going to try and trade them because I want at least one Doyoung postcard. And then this is the Take Over the Moon sequel postcard and I got Yang Yang. And then this is the Writing Reload poster for Heitan. And then I like put, if I have duplicates, I like put them together just so I don't like lose track of what is what. But this is writing for Jamin. And then I have two Renjun ones. And then this one has three Geno rolling ones. And I have. I think I have three of these as well. 
and then two Kenya. So like I said, I'm probably gonna sell these. So if you guys are interested, my selling account is gonna be in the description box. And then this is my wavy poster. So I have 10 and then this is the other one. So this is the other version and I got Lucas. So let's check out the circle cards next. So um, this one is Taeyong from Neozone T version. My friend had given this to me because she doesn't really like circle cards and she didn't know what to do with them. And I mean, I don't really care for them either because they don't fit properly in my like little holder right now because I have like a business card holder and the sleeves are a lot smaller. I did buy new sleeves and like a binder <laughs> so I can hold these because it doesn't look like SM is gonna get rid of them anytime soon. But so this is the back of it. And then these are my final round album one. So I have Tail Tail. Um, I think this is second player. And then I got two Tails and one Johnny. And then so I think is our first player. I'm gonna try and trade for Doyoung when I get my other albums in, and hopefully I can because I know this album has been out for a while. So hopefully somebody will honor trade with me if I don't get Doyoung. And then let's see. So let's switch my wavy circle card. So Lucas, this one is for, is this for Awaken the World? And then Xiao Jun, uh, also for Awaken the World, but I know I butchered his name and I've watched that video where he like pronounces his name in like the different like ways like Chinese, Korean and then how like you like English speakers say it and I'm pretty sure I say it the same way English speakers say it and he was like so embarrassed to even like attempt it but I cannot like pronounce it in Chinese for some reason like it just does not like roll off my tongue properly and then I got Kun and Kun for takeoff oh my gosh <laughs> um why can I not think uh take over the moon is that what it is? Oh my gosh, why can't I not remember it right now? But yeah, I got Kuhn for both of them. And then these are my dream pools. So I got Chenla, Chenla, Renjun, Jeno, Jeno and Jeno for the rolling versions. So. And then I got Renjun. Jeno and Hyeton for my um, writing versions. And then Jamin, We Boom. So this actually came with that bundle that I had gotten um, because the seller was like, wow, you guys bought so much stuff. Have this Jamin circle card. But yeah, so this is the photo card that came with the the dream Japanese CD and this is the back of it which is so pretty I love this color and then Jeno this came with the dream show photo book actually I had pulled Hechan and I traded with my friend because that's her bias and I'd rather her have him than me because why would I keep my friends bias if I could just trade with them and then I got Jeno for writing, reload, um, Jamin, Chenla, Renjun, Jisung, Jisung. And then for rolling, I got Jisung. Jisung's signature is so cute with his like little face especially because he like changes it between like like different like versions or whatever Jamin Chenla I pulled like 11 of these which is fine <laughs> but in a group order it's like so annoying because not everyone biases Chenla and what am I gonna do with all of his 
and I feel so bad when people don't get their like first choice pulls or even like their second choice pulls but it is what it is and then I got Jamin from my Kino so actually my friend and I we bought the Kinos together and I was like if I pull Heichan I'll trade with you and she's like if I pull Jamin I'll trade with you and she pulled Jamin and I pulled Jeno so she actually traded with me I really love the little bunnies that he draws in his signature and then my wavy albums so 10 for awaken the world 10 for the other awaken the world version 10 again for take over the moon so i got it right earlier it's just my mind was like boggled for some reason and then win win for take over the moon sequel uh, and then for my kinos this is player two so i got Doyoung, I traded Hechan for this one um, because I didn't pull any Doyoungs in my expansive Kino buying. So I traded for him and then Hechan. I'm trying to trade this one for Taeyong, so if anyone's interested, just let me know. Version 2, or player 2. And then I have player 1 for. I have Taeyong for player 1. Oh my gosh. And then Doyoung. So I traded another Hechan for this one. And then these are my regular, the final round pulls. Um, I got Jungwoo and Yuta. So the backs are actually the same color, so I don't know the difference. But yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know it's kind of long and kind of chaotic.